What's going on everybody? It's your boy Tom here with Tom Rea Sports and today we're just going to go over some MLB wildcard series predictions. Playoffs begin tomorrow and I couldn't be any more excited. It's almost like a March Madness type format with how many games we get to see as baseball fans. It's almost like baseball heaven. All right, enough of that. Uh, let's get right into it. First series we'll talk about briefly is the Rays against the Toronto Blue Jays. Um, so this is um, obviously kind of the Rays are heavily favorite here. Number one seed in the American League. I expect them to win this pretty easily, probably in a two-game sweep. Maybe Blue Jays squeak one out, but we're going to go ahead and say Tampa wins that one 2-0. Next series is Athletics against the White Sox. Look, I mean, the one thing I worry about with Oakland is their starting pitching. Their bullpen's great. Their lineup's pretty good, not great, but good. Um, But their starting pitching, to me, is a little bit skeptical. I think the White Sox are a more well-rounded team. They have Keuchel and Giolito going as their one-two punch. Their bullpen's not bad. They have one of the best closers in the game in Colome. And then, obviously, their lineup is awesome. So I'm going to actually take the upset here, and I'm going to pick Chicago to win this series in Game 3, obviously on the road. Now, if you're not familiar, the higher seed gets to play all of the three games at their home stadium. So a little bit of an advantage, but with no fans, not anything too drastic. So that being said, I'm going to pick the White Sox here. Next series is the Twins up against the Astros. Obviously, the Astros haven't had their best year. Who knows if it was impacted by, you know, everything that's gone on. I'd say it has, but that's another debate for another day. Uh, Twins should win this one pretty easily. Again, I'm going to take them to win 2-0. Astros, they just don't really have much to compete with Minnesota, in my opinion. So we're taking Minnesota. Uh, Indians-Yankees, this might be the best series of the first round. I'm torn on this because, in all honesty, I am a Yankee fan, and I have a little bias here, so I think they're going to win in three games, but I mean, game one, Tuesday night, is going to really decide a lot. I mean, Bieber, Cole, both teams, aces going at it. I think whoever wins that game is going to win the series. I know that's easy to say in a three-game series, but compared to the other series around the league, this game one means more than any. Um, Yankees have better hitting, Indians have better pitching. Pitching usually wins in the postseason, but I think the Yankees bullpen is better. So I'm torn. I think my bias is leading me on the Yankees, but you go at your own discretion. I'm taking the Yankees to win this series in three. Uh, Now on to the National League, Dodgers, Brewers. Now the one issue with the 16 game playoff is you get some very lopsided series in the American League. It's not so bad, but this series, uh, it looks pretty bad on paper, at least anything can happen because it is baseball and who knows brewers maybe could shock the world. But I mean, if the Dodgers lose this series, I mean, that's, I mean, 2020 has already been crazy, but that would be, that'd be something else. So I'm going to take the Dodgers in two. I think they win that finish that one on Thursday. Uh, Braves reds. Awesome series. This is, I love this series. Just incredible pitching on the red side, credible hitting on the brave side. Um, Braves are the favorite. I think they do end up pulling this out in three games, but I'm I mean, my heart is telling me the I want the Reds. So we're gonna pick the Braves here. Sorry if that was a little confusing. But man, I'd love to see the Reds win that series. Um, next, Cubs Miami. Another series that's not really that exciting. Cubs offense has been pretty bad all year long. Chris Bryant, I think, has nine RBIs on the season and like a two hundred average. So that's just I mean, really sad, so to speak. But um, Cubs pitching has been pretty good. You Darvish probably going to be the runner up in the NL Cy Young vote. I'm kind of torn on this. I'm going to actually pick Miami here. Um, I know it might shock a lot of people. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take them though. I like some of their stuff. They're hitting. I think their lineup is a little more well balanced. They're young. They're hot. I think they have nothing really to lose here. And I'm going to pick Miami to upset in three games. Then Padres Cardinals. Everyone loves the Padres. Super excited for this series. Um, Cardinals, again, offense a little bit challenged. They've dealt with probably more adversity than anybody considering they had to make up, you know, was it 20, 20 games, something like that. They were behind at one point. But um, Padres, I think, will win this series in two. I think they get the two-game sweep and advance on to the divisional round. So that's all of our picks for the wild card series. Uh, We'll have more predictions before the divisional round begins. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And thanks for watching. Have a good one, everybody.